river. Regardless of what kind of person it was, I always put them in the river. It was just fun to do. Oh dear. I really don't know what happens if you completely exhaust the horse. I have a feeling it probably just keels over. Not as in it dies, I think I mean it just probably falls over and you fall off of it. I really don't know if that is the case. Hmm. To be fair, I've never let the horse get to that state because it slows down considerably when it gets to next to no stamina, so I just leave off and let it just trot along. Now the question is, will the guards be pissed? Nope. All's good then. So the vagabond is down below. Are these steps or is it a ladder? It's a ladder. Eh. Oh no! Oh there we go. Hello, vagabond. Jesus Christ be praised. I've got your coin. <laughs> I'd like to see that bastard's face when he finds out it's gone. I'll give you some of the groschen back, like I promised. And I've got another job for you. Oh, bollocks. What's this? What's this other job then? Everywhere you go here, you'll see wretches like me. Poor souls that don't have a pot to piss in and have to beg. Then take a look and rat eye at all the gentle folk with their noses in the air. Looking out only for themselves with not a moment's thought for the poor. Well, from one fine lady, you could get arms to feed the whole lot of us here. Ah, oh, crap. Arms for everyone. <laughs> that would be quite a purse. But I'll see what I can do. That's the spirit. In return, I'll teach you something useful, and you'll get a share too, of course. Okay. Oh, wait. I'll give him 50 of my own. I don't care. Here's the coin you wanted. Did you steal it? Keep after your effort. So you only gave him 25. Another job? Oh my god. Sure. You mentioned another job. All ears. Aye. There's a good widow living in squalor with us in the camp. She sold the last memento she had of her sainted mother to a moneylender so she could feed her young ones. And now she's so torn with regret, she can't sleep nights. You want me to get this memento back? Just so. I'd do it myself. Only, I can't show my face on the town square without the catchpoles kicking my arse. Steal her ring back from that usurer. Wolf from Pruda. You can pick your own reward while you're at it. He's so rich it ain't decent. Okay. I'll be right back. Pruda. Steal a silver ring. That sounds like a difficult thing. Oh dear. Pruda. I don't remember who Pruda is. It sounds like a merchant. Maybe I could just buy the ring. Have you got a ring I could have? Pruda. It doesn't sound like a citizen, it sounds like a merchant. Well, maybe I... no? Oh! Oh, God. It's another... It's a guard again. Ye, good people. God damn it. Such are happening. Oh, I'm not entirely sure if I have much on me. See, hang on. Merchant sword. Common say... I actually have a fair bit. Oh. In that case, I might actually sell some stuff. Yeah, it might make make me a bit of money. Doodle doodle doo. Hello, Mr. Armor Smith. Jesus Christ. Yeah, indeed. Trade. May the Lord watch you. You have two K. Oh, perfect. My reputation is fifty-two. Oh dear. I think the worse your reputation, the the less you can get for your stuff. So there's fifty-three. Okay. They're worth quite a bit, though. There's not real much difference between those. Uh. Okay. I mean, I'm still going to get a fair bit from him. I can't sell weapons. Damn. Check basket. Let's haggle. If you'll let me. No, oh, I thought it wasn't going to let me then. Let's have a word about the. Well. Wow. Right, you're at seven. 10. Let's try 7.50. Aye, that would do it. So that would work. Hell yeah. Not bad. Cabbage, cabbage, green cabbage. 
Cruda. Oh, it's this guy. Wonder, can I just talk it out of him? Oh, I actually have to get it off of him. That's a bit of a shame. Yeah, the stealing stuff's the worst, because I don't trust it. Because if anybody sees it, they call the guards and everything. So that's another quest. It seems to be all the stealing quests I don't do in the day. I have to wait until it's night time. Where's my horse? Oh there, God. I don't know where the bloody old pebbles went to. God, they're all just shouting about the same sort of things. Uh, I got a new skill. Horsemanship. So what can I get? Dread Steed. Is wounded, it'll run faster. Horse will be extremely skittish in storms, but will shy less in any other weather. 15% damage bonus in mountain combat. No thanks, mounted combat's awkward. Won't shy at nearby foes, at least as long as no one hits him. That'll do. Hell yeah! Alright, now back to my quest log. What do I want to do next? I'm not going to do... the... yeah, rob the rich, give to the poor. So that's a pain. Chumps on the river we've already done. Raiders and Beggar's Feast. But in order to do Beggar's Feast I need hair meat, which means I need to find hairs. I also don't know why I'm still holding a torch. It's, it'll be night time soon. So I'm just prepared. A day in advance. And I know there's the quest with Sir Hans at the bathhouse, but thankfully it's not timed. At least until you start the quest. And I just don't want to do that anytime soon, because I need really high lockpicking in order to get through it. I know Peshek has some quests. Or tasks, I suppose. I don't know if I want to do them, because it's more stealing. Stealing's a pain. It's probably the most common crime, and it's not like you're murdering somebody. You still just have to pay like 200 grosh in, though. Oh well. So where I'm thinking... Yeah, I can't go anywhere up there. I suppose I just go straight across to Ladechko. And go from there, I suppose. Actually, in fairness, I might just fast travel. It takes a while, but it's quicker than going on your own. Yeah. Talenberg. Although the green is for... I'm not entirely sure. Was that the... the Tanner? Or was it... Captain Robard? Don't actually know. Because Robard would... you'd think he'd be in Talmberg Keep. So for him to be out in the village just seems a bit peculiar. And a bit weird. Hmm. Oh well. I'm also curious whether or not we'll get stopped along the road. Because the raiders quest that we have is all to do with humans, which are people we've not actually had much experience fighting. Not in particular. Like, we fought a fair few of them. But nothing compared to, like, just regular old bandits. Which is probably good, because humans are kind of a pain. They're a lot, I don't know if I'd say they're more experienced than the bandits, but they seem to be more heavily armoured. And obviously that makes them more of a, more of a, more of a threat. And it's night time. Great. Means I can't see anything. I do have my torch out still though, so I'll be safe there. Right, so, hopefully Robard will be awake. If he's asleep, then that's just kind of screwed this plan. I mean, the, the, I think the weapon I have is a mace. That's the one I use. Mace is my go-to weapon, honestly. Purely because it's the... I think it's the only weapon that ignores armor. So, regardless of wearing, whether an enemy's wearing a helmet, it'll still do the same amount of damage. Well, maybe not the same amount, but it'll do a fair bit. A fair bit. So that's good. 
Right, Robard! I have no idea where he'll be. I've definitely got that selected, don't I? Raiders. Yeah, I do. It's the green one. Uh, okay. So he's... somewhere else. On the plus side, he isn't asleep. There he is! Robard! I'm honored that you should come. Indeed. Uh oh wait, I can hand over trophies. Sure. I have some trophies. Show me. So many. <laughs> My lad, you're like the smiting right hand of God. So many. You have a singular ear. Captain Bernard sent me. I've been sent by Captain Bernard. Oh Bernard. He says you have Cuma Marauders here. Ah, so it was you Bernard was Bernard. Was speaking of. Well, the Cumans are marauding, that's for sure. Oh dear. So Givish did declare a decent reward for taking the bastards down. But we've not had cause to pay out to anyone so far. Is that because the locals are too frightened? No. They're more than willing to try. It's just they don't seem to make it back again. But don't let me put you off. We do know of one camp. Along the road to Neuhof, hidden between the cliffs. I'll pay you your reward if you can bring me proof you've killed the camp leader. They wear peculiar helmets with a face mask of sorts. Easy to recognize. Of course. All right. I'll see to it. Take care now. Yeah, the bastards are going down. Why the hell's that flashing? Okay. Because the game wanted to save, I suppose. Oh, my horse can't get here. Jesus, what a lot of shit. Can my horse get here? You damn right he can. There he is. It's between Noyoff. That seems like really far away. Noy whoop. What that's not near Noyoff at all. Noyoff's there. That's closer to like uh nowhere actually. You don't say Mehoyed, but it's not even close to that. Okay. Plus side, I was going to say is that it's in the forest, but at night time, that just seems like a bad idea. I mean, I can do it, but I'm I'm ever so slightly worried. Don't really like going into the forest at night. It seems to bring out the worst. And again, you can actually fight with one hand weapon, and you can still block. Because that was the one thing I had an issue with, or at least I thought would be an issue. I thought if you didn't have a shield, you couldn't block, but you do, you just block with the weapon. It's just less effective. Why are there so many people out? I think I'm going the right way. Just need to go south into the forest. Essentially. And then I'll soon stumble acro across them. The worst part about night time is you can't tell how many people are in a camp. So, I mean, as long as I can kill the leader, it's not such a big deal. Still makes it a bit of a pain, though. Okay, well, I don't think we're anywhere near close at this moment in time. Oh no, it's, it's filling out a bit. Filling it in a bit. Just how close are we, then? Oh, we're right around the corner. I don't... Actually, wait, if the smoke on the map represents a camp, then that might actually be where they're located. Which means taking a right. Oh, what the hell happened to my horse? Why did it decide to go up the hill? Oh god, where is the path? I think I'm on it again. And the path should split at some point soon. There we go. It's up here. I see animals. Don't see no people. Huh. Aha. Uh -huh. Uh-oh. They're running. Oh, that's definitely them. Oh wow, hi. Nichok, Nichok, be with it, fellas. <laughs> Nichok, Nichok. God damn, I don't like fighting multiple. As we the love it puts. Eat, eat the fellowship. Okay. Oh. 
the hell's happening? That was really weird. I'm completely forgetting to block as well. It sucks because they're not they're not using like torches or anything. That missed. Oh, are you serious? Getting attacked by multiple is the worst. Also, humans are very likely to block, which is what makes them the worst. On the plus side, I'm in good armor, so I should be okay. I will definitely need repairing. Fuck off! <laughs> God damn! Constantly getting smacked about. This is the worst part about fighting at night time. Okay, it would help if it would... If they would not decide to just rush me. Ow, oh, I keep missing! Ay ay ay. Yep, every single time. You're good at blocking. I'm surprised I managed to get that off. There we go. Just jab him. Just jab in the face. That's all I want to do. Almost got him. Down to half fucking hell. This is why I prefer to just charge them. Keep going for the jabs. A what? Fuck's sake. Oh great. I'm getting bashed about. My armor's gonna be in pretty shit condition. Are you serious? <laughs> These are really the worst. Hey, we got the camp leader! That does not mean that's why he was so difficult. It's because they're humans, and humans fucking suck. I really just want to bash this guy. There we go. Bashy bash. Headcracker. Perfect. Oh wait, I've already killed him. Wait, have I killed him? He ain't dead. Well, he is now. <laughs> yeah! So I can grab the shield. I don't need the weapons. There, There's like two more guys left. And I don't think they're really going to be much of an issue. Cumania! Oh, whoa. Harness? That must be what's on his chest. It is. Huh. Alright, so one of those, one of those. Mostly just want to take stuff that's actually worth something. That's worth a lot. It's also put me over, but whatever. Yay, there we go. Cumans are assholes. What did my armor do? Like, how badly did my armor get screwed? Not badly, really. What about my chest? That got quite bad. Um, I might be able to repair some of it. Well, <laughs> I tried. Uh, it won't be any of the blacksmiths. Oh. Yeah, I thought that uh, it must have been a small armor's kit that I was using. That's all I can use. Armor's kit. Oh, there's still more. Oh, there they all go. Crap. Hmm. Not bad. And there's this guy who also died. Bandit ear. Leader's mask. Oh, wow. That's worth 800? Jesus. You can tell he's the leader. My god. Oh. Just grab the body. Move him elsewhere. There you go. Just so I can take what he had on him. Although I'm certain, where's his sword? Don't forget the leader's faceplate. Oh, there's the sword. I'm over encumbered by a bit. There's also more of them. Oh shoot, I can't see. Where'd he go? Huh. I could have sworn I saw a guy in white walking this way. 
Can you just run away? That's all very hard, not a chance in hell. Huh. Uh, just had to loot him. I mean, he had no need for it. And it's worth a lot of money. That's mostly what I care for. Aha! Surprise! I got him! I really hope you were a human. Oh, you were. Good. Wait, what's the mercy kill with a bow? Oh, they're in one. I mean, killing him was slightly unneeded, but... They destroyed Scalettes. They deserve to die. I think... Was that the only guy, then? I think so. I may drop everything off my horse. I'll put everything in the horse. Just because it's weighing me down a lot. What if I get rid of both of those? Merchant sword, sure. Spike club. Oh wow, I have a lot of stuff. Nice. Mercy kill. It's basically they're, they're bleeding out. Essentially is what ha what's happening. And mercy kill can allow you to just finish them off. Because I think if they aren't dead, you're not able to loot them. But I'm not 100% on that. Every time I see an animal, I always think it's a hare. I, mean, I just saw that deer, and I was like, oh, it's a hare! There's a hare! Yay! Oh, no, I can't see. Oh, okay, this could be interesting. Hunting in the dark. Where's the hare? Oh, no. This is, like, the worst idea. There's the hare. Hunting wabbits. Okay, it speeds up because I got close. I need your hair meat. Okay, you are like zooming. The fuck? I can't see. Like, I'm trying to spot it. Oh, wait, I see it. And then it saw me. Shoot. Okay, hunting in the dark is pointless. Like, you can't see a thing. Go on, put the bow away. There we go. Ah, well. I need to kill hares. I need hair meat. And hair pelts. I mean, what time are we at? Could do, just wait. Maybe the hares will still be around. Because to be fair, I need to go out of my way and find them. Because... Running along the road seems to be pointless now. They don't seem to appear at the side of the road anymore. They used to, because that's probably where I first found so many of them when I first played, but not anymore. Ah, bugger. I need a hair pelt for the tanner in Talmberg, and I need 90 hair meat for... Was he Alex? Was it Alex? Back in Ratai. Well, it's still night time. Fuck. It's better than nothing. I'll wait for another hour. <laughs> Actually, can I cancel this whenever? Would that work? I'm curious. If cancelling actually just cancels and puts the time back to what it was, or if you can cancel waiting whenever you want. Oh, you can. Oh, that's useful. I know it's daytime, I can actually see. And I see a hair. Shooting arrows is a pain. I think I missed. I can't actually tell. I can't see where the trajectory of the arrow is going. All I know is I'm not hitting this, this, this bunny. Or this hair. Okay, the, the tra tra trajectory is just not working. What am I using? Hunting arrows. So they're fine. Also, I know hunting, I'm making it look terrible, or it looks like I'm terrible at archery, but trust me, it's very difficult. Maybe if I get a better angle, I might have a better look. For some reason, I can't shoot this thing. Got it. I think it's dead. 
Oh my god, are you serious? I missed it by an inch. <laughs> Not even. How? <laughs> oh my god. I didn't even get hair pelt. Oh, what a lot of crap. I've got 22. I need to find more hairs. Finding them is a difficult thing. I don't know, I just think they've turned down how many hairs actually appear in the world. I've definitely noticed that I see a lot less of them now than I used to. Um, I'm over encumbered by hair meat. Really? And not every hair gives off a pelt, which is kind of shitty. Hang on. Oh, I could have sworn I saw something. That's because I did. Yes. Although it's in the bushes, which is the worst. Oh, there it is. Fuck. <laughs> you think the the bunny would want to run away? Got it. Oh, there we go. Hair pelt. Perfect. So that's two hair pelts. I need one more. I have 300 arrows, so I shouldn't really worry about missing. And with archery, the way I see it... Like, the way it works for me, personally, is it takes me a couple arrows to kind of get my bearing. Because archery in this is a lot harder than any other game. Or, like, I'm used to, like, archery of, like, the Elder Scrolls series, and in that, it's super simple. But you have also, you've got a crosshair, so you can constantly see where you're aiming. Oh my god, bars. Does it, do arrows even work? No. <laughs> if you want to make them make a lot of noise, then yes, they do. Where am I? This is a waste of an arrow, but whatever. I don't really care for bars. I want hairs. I just need one more. I've also forgot where Pebbles is, but if I call him, he should be able to find me. Come on, little hairs, where are you? Being in a lot of brush, not helpful. Hairs, where are you? I don't know what the heck made them so uncommon, unless they only appear around very specific places. I have really no idea. The hell is this? An interesting sight. It's a house that was burned down? Maybe just abandoned. Most probably just abandoned. Hmm. Oh my god, another hair. Okay, maybe they are still rather common. Oh my god, that was a good shot. Hell yeah. Oh, nice. I still need to kill more for the, the meat though. Alright, so I've got hair skin, so that's cool. I can do the Tanner's mission. I need 60... Uh, not 60. I need 23. And it seems that most hairs only give 22. Which would mean I need to kill two more. Which is great. <laughs> Although the plus side is it doesn't matter. The... The quality of the meat that I give to Alex, I'm pretty sure it could be rotting. Or... Not rotting, but it could be at zero and they would still accept it, I think. At least I hope so. If you have to take him food that's good, then that's gonna suck. Because I'm pretty sure you can only turn it in once you've gotten 90. Which is seemingly not that easy. Hmm. I thought that was a bloody hair then. Nope, it's a tree. So what's, are these plants? No. Done. Hmm. Yeah, the worst part is I just don't know where to even begin. Like, looking for hairs. I just seem to come across them. Or I seem to be lucky enough to come across them. But I don't know where Pebbles is. Kind of abandoned him to go searching for hairs. It was not intended. To be honest, I still think the best place to find them is where we went on that quest with Sir Hans. Because that was a quest that was entirely hunting. Um, hairs. Oh, 
I see another. Shit. Oh. Get closer. What? He's gonna get close to me and then run away. Knew it. Damn it. Hairs are a pain in the ass to shoot. They're such a small target, I think that's what makes them quite a pain. We got it. As it rolls down the hill. Give me 23 meat, please. 22. Damn it. I need more. Not even much more, just... I need one more meat. Oh, there. Fuck, I didn't even notice. Leap. Yeah! Whew. There we go, we got all the meat. Perfect. Oh, that one gave me 23, because of course it did. Asshole. Oh wait, I didn't want to go crouch. I pressed the left stick to start running. Wait, is that Pebbles right ahead? I think it is. 